Kalidaya, I'm Analytic Marold and welcome to, well, another top 5 video on my channel. This is actually the second top 5 I'm doing and um, there are some spoilers on the screen already right over there. Um, yeah, the second top 5, wow, this is kind of loud for me. Wait, 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 you're gonna see this. Oh no, my music library. Oh no, gee golly good. Okay, so yeah, my second, my second uh, top five video. Um, how to say this? Uh, the first one wasn't kind of the best, but go check it out. Still, link in the description, probably. If not, just go to my channel because if you're not subscribed, what the hell you're doing with your life? But anyway, yeah. So today's top five video is in fact top five legendary Pokemon. My top five legendary Pokemon. There we go. If you're excited, be sure to leave a like down below. Also, before I jump into it, let me just tell you that this video is going to be opinionated. This is, of course, my only, uh, this is only my opinion. And in the comment section below, let me know what's your, what are your top five favorite Pokemon, legendary Pokemon. So, yeah, with that, um, I think it's, 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 Let's just jump into it, okay? That's what I'm trying to say. So number five, number five. Also, there's not gonna be any editing because um, I'm a lazy motherfucker and there's something on my screen. Or is there, no, there's gonna be editing. Okay, I'm gonna edit this shit, but it's not gonna be like number five. Okay, number five, ba-bam, bam. Okay, no, let's get an explosion up in this page. Ba-bam, here we go. And let's 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 have some confetti, huh? Hey, number five. There we go. So Darkrai, number five. The um, what's it called? The pitch black Pokemon, the darkness Pokemon, the dark void Pokemon. Even. I mean, oh, Darkrai is actually amazing. It used to be even better. In uh, I I well, all of my picks are kind of mainly based on competitive. Not really mainly based but are somewhat based on competitive and somewhat on the design. And I, I really like the design of Darkrai with those shoulder pads or uh, what are... Yeah, the shoulder pads. It's it's dark Pokemon with the red. Red and black really work well together. Also, the white cap kind of looks like a freaking leprechaun. But I don't mind it. I, I really like the design. And let's just see here. Let's just see here. Some Pokedex entries. Um, it afflicts damage with nightmare, yeah, it, it, blah, blah, blah. So it can lure people to sleep and make them eat dreams. I mean, if you think about it, uh, yeah, I don't care about the Pokedex entry, honestly, but uh, for Darkrai at least. Um, Darkrai is, it used to be so good. I played Auras, Ubers, and it used to be actually kind of broken. Uh, massive, massive special attack if we scroll down here. Massive speed, massive special attack with the move Dark Void, which used to be 85% accurate. Now it's only 50% accurate, but uh, which kind of eh, eh, um, kind of makes Darkrai not as good as it used to be. But I, I still like the design very much. So yeah, with that, um, Darkrai deserves a spot on number five. I mean, number five spot on my top five. God damn it. <laughs> so yeah, moving on, moving on. Ooh, number four. And I'm gonna I'm gonna have to do more editing because of this. But anyway, fade out, fade in. Number four, Entei. Um, Entei, why is it my favorite? Uh, I mean, uh, my fourth favorite legendary Pokemon. Because my first game, fun fact, was actually Pokemon Crystal, Crystal, <laughs> Crystal, um, Crystal. My po Pokemon Crystal. Yes. And when playing my Pokemon Crystal version, um, there was this moment in which I once ran into an Entei. Of course, uh, Entei is a roaming legendary in Crystal, Gold and Silver. And, well, I couldn't do anything. It ran away from me, right? And, you know, the, the things you can't have is are the things you want even more. So. I wanted, I wanted that freaking Entei, and I, I lurked for it. No, I, what? I hunted for it like crazy, and in the end, I caught it. I threw my Master Ball, and I caught myself an Entei. 
Also, when it barks, volcanoes er erupt, right? Um, I know this, this here. Uh, when it roars, a volcano erupts somewhere around the globe. Can you imagine that? Jesus, that's, that's freaking amazing. Oh, also it's similar to Arcanine, which is also a key part. I mean, it's a fire dog. I love dogs. I said this for Arcanine already. I love fire dogs and yeah. And they definitely top five, number four to be exact. So moving on again, another fade out. <laughs> number number three spot is Dialga. Now why Dialga? Um, I don't really know why. I I feel like the design is well. It's a bombast design, you know, with this the steel dragon typing. That's definitely something that's has to be accounted. Uh, that has to be known. That has to be you know what I'm trying to say. God damn it! Can't find the right word. Um, the steel dragon typing is amazing. Um, it is the time Pokemon, the temporal Pokemon, or it's the, it's the master of time. And when I played, I played um, a lot of. Uh, fourth gen Pokemon games because fourth gen is Sinnoh is my favorite region so My hair is all messed up again. Hey, hey um, oh, oh, Shit, yeah, uh, Sinnoh is my favorite region and I I caught a Dialga always um, when I was playing on the emulator and yeah, I caught a di Dialga always. It's just so fucking awesome. I mean, it's the it's the move. It's the keeper of time. It is uh, the time Pokemon. And I, I also one fun fact about me. I I really uh, like the idea of time travel, and I'm fascinated by well, this uh, theories of time travel or the movies which includes time travel. I'm I'm sold. I'm definitely sold. So. Um, Time flows when Dialga's heartbeat beats. Beats. Anyway, yeah, super super cool design. Great typing. Um, competitive setup. Setup rocks. I mean, decent stats. I I didn't say. I mean, decent. It's got 150 special attack, but that doesn't really matter because I've never really used Dialga. But I love the Steel Dragon typing, and I love the design so much. So now another fade out. Ooh, number two Pokemon. Are we are almost nearing the end? See, I mean, let's just go for it. Um, Latios. Why Latios? I mean, uh, it's I really like the both both of the Lati twins, but Latias just, eh, it's kind of too girly for me. I mean, that sounds super sexist or. Latias is just not for me. And uh, in the movie, the Ash movie, the with the Lati Twins movies, you know, Latios is kind of mature. It's it's got its shit together, and that's something you, which is appealing, to me at least. I, I am I am attracted to people who got their shit together, who know what they're doing in life, um, who have a freaking vision, or who who know exactly what to do, or and who think things through. And I feel like Latios is one of those Pokemon which resemble that. Apart from that, that I'm using it in a league now, and I absolutely love it. Uh, it's a bomb as Pokemon competitive. Drop in Dracos everywhere. 130 special attack, 110 speed. That's all you need. 90 attack if you want to go Dragon and set. Maybe. Wait, where are the stats? Ho ho ho! And this song, <laughs> Jesus Christ! As if, as if I'm not all over the place already. Um, yeah, so 130, 110, 110, 90 Dragon and set possible. I'm bringing a Dragon and set one of these weeks. Um, but anyway. Yeah, Latios, super cool design. Um, I don't really like the Megas because Latias and Latios are kind of similar, and I don't like that they are because see, the, I I I want this difference to be here to be present uh, with Latias and Latios. As I said, uh, Latios, he's got its shit together. It it's got its he's got his shit together. It's got its. It doesn't matter. It's male, so he's got his shit together, right? And he has it in a bag, in a backpack, um, or in a bag. And he has it at this shit store. He sold it. <laughs> no, <laughs> God damn it! These are Rick and Morty references. Okay. Um, anyway, super cool design. I like. I love the blue, but shiny is better in my opinion because that it's just the right eff uh, effect. Um, what to think? Uh, shade. It's just the right shade of. Uh, 
green if we look at it it's kind of emeraldy no, no I, I don't know how this color is called but i i love it so much because usually what they do with shiny pokemon that are green like espion espion is a vomit green color and i don't like that but this one this one is kind of bluish greenish and it, oh my god oh my god oh my god anyway 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 let's get this shit done so last 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 pokemon number one now before I reveal my number one Pokemon. Be sure to leave a like down below if you haven't already to show the support. <sighs> Are you ready for my number one, top one favorite, my all time favorite legendary Pokemon? Drum roll, please. Oh no, wait, I, I'm editing this shit. So, drum roll, please. And the fade out. Ta -da! It's Reshiram! Uh, okay, okay. How I feel about Reshiram, no one knows. Uh, I mean, I know. Again, a shiny form, even better than usual. I love this shiny so much. It's so minimalistic, and but it just works so great. Oh my god. Um, because the gold the gold necklace or and the rings on the, its tail, it looks so damn great. I, I don't know how you can't love this. It, this looks bombast. There's nothing to say. Yeah, it kind of resembles a chicken, but not not the way I see it. I mean, the way I see it, it's just a magnificent beast. Again, when I played a lot of, I played, I always played black Pokemon Black because I always wanted a Reshiram. Zagram just kind of eh, doesn't feel right when you have a Reshiram here. And also, fun fact: in my Oras, no, in my Omega Ruby copy, I soft reset it for a shiny uh, Reshiram. Which today, to this day, I still have, of course, on my. Uh, I transferred it uh, through Pokebank to Sun and Moon. But uh, it's just so magnificent, so majestic, and uh, okay. The movie, the movie is also. Oh, okay. The movie is so great with uh, the the Zekrom, the Reshiram movie. This legendary Pokemon can scorch the world with fire. It helps those who want to build the world of truth. Well, what, what, what else do you need? What else do you want? This is perfection. Perfection in a Pokemon. I love Reshiram. <laughs> it's a chicken. I don't care if it's a chicken. I love it. I, I will always love it. And I named my uh, shiny uh, uh, Iro, actually. Iro, after the um, Avatar, the Airbender. <laughs> anyway, if you enjoyed this top 5 video, let me know in the comment section below, um, let me know if you want to see more, of course, um, let me know also what your top 5 is, leave a like, I said that already, share with your friends, that's always appreciated, and with that, uh, thanks for washing, thanks for washing, yeah, thanks for washing your laundry, so, <laughs> thanks for watching, um, and this is it for me. Uh, I'm out. Bye-bye.